um, raised rubber logo on the sleeve. So, so everyone so knows. Sporty. What'd you say? So active, so sporty. Yeah. Um, is it um, is it like a down alternative fill inside the quilt? And are there darts in the back? Is it like shaped and fitted? Turn around. Yeah, it is shaped. Um, for sure. You can feel there's just like princess themes I think that come from the armhole. Yeah. And then that's okay. So yeah. that's really nice. So yeah, you, you are getting shape. You're not just like a blob in it. Um, yeah. and then I did look up the fill before I, yeah. Um, and it's not true down. So yeah, you don't have to worry about that. You know, okay, so allergies, it's all, it's a, it's a down alternative. Yeah. Yeah. And like, you don't have to feel bad about, you know, the animals, yeah. the animals, you know. I so I feel so bad anytime I buy anything that has down, which is really really rare. It's usually like a, like a couple pillows in the past like ten years, but yeah. but I do feel bad. You I mean you just hope that it's coming from a, an ethical source, but it's often not. So the, really, the surefire way of going about it is just get alternative. I agree, and yeah, I just feel like I also know so many people that are allergic, so you should, I mean, obviously, you know, maybe you still eat meat and all of that, and you're a little less worried about the animals, but for yourself. Yeah, I just went down alternative pillows, and I just laid it down here in this, like, uh, like guest room sort of fit, because I was like, yeah, a lot of people have an allergy, so it doesn't make sense to invest in a down pillow. Just get a nice, high-quality synthetic, and honestly, feels just advice. Yeah. Mainly it's like Amy and Jack, I think, are allergic. And those are people that... Oh, are allergic? Right? Too. And those are people that, like, would sleep. In, well, I mean, Jack sleeps in my bed. And, like, Amy, you know, might stay at my apartment. And so you got you to gotta be good to your friends and your husband. Yeah. You can be. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know. Um, well, I guess we should keep going. <laughs> Like we're from, we're kind of over time, but we started late, so maybe we'll just do a couple more, just quickly, and whatever. I'll keep this on; it's fine. Nobody's being forced to stay. Taylor's being forced to stay, but he's a good sport. He's a good sport. Wait, did this work? Okay, so I had to like hastily grab this from my shower where it lives. Oh, are you trying to sell candors? I'm just joking. I was trying to get my very shop sales in, like. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna have to take part in that sale. That sounds like a steal. It honestly is when there's a good when there's a twenty, even fifteen, whatever, twenty percent off for these Brooklyn candle studio company uh, candles, like they're honestly a really good value. And they make such nice housewarming gifts and they're really nice fragrances. And I have all of them, so I'm gonna go over all of them. But whatever, I don't I don't know what day yet, so I should just to shut up. Yeah, I mean, well, speaking of nice fragrances, 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 um, fragrances, this Indie Lee body wash, de-stress, calm and unwind, uh, is my favorite thing. It smells like the nicest hotel you've ever stayed in. Oh, it smells well, so good. Good hotels, it just feels so, like, mature. It really is, and, like, I'm bad at, no, I'm bad at parsing out. Sense, which I feel like you're probably really good at. I feel like I know you're really well, good I'm at a it. Giant bush, but no, stop it. You're just petite. You know, you just can't smell anything through there. It's just a little button. Any chance you get to talk about how big your nose is, any chance, any chance, you will. Well, I only have so many more opportunities once I get it fixed, you know, that I won't be able to. You will not. You are not doing that, sir. We'll see. Oh, my God. Ugh. I can't. I can't with him. But if this conversation is stressing you out, you should buy this because it will <laughs> calm you down. It does say um, there's patchouli, lavender, rosemary, eucalyptus, vitamins A and B. Um, there's some quinoa. So these are all like amazing scents and ingredients and... I just, I really love it. I, yeah, I use it every day. And when I run out of it, I'm, I'm ordering more. It's the best. Definitely. Oh yeah. Does it lather nicely and does it rinse cleanly and does it leave you feeling hydrated or what? 
Yeah, it's great. All of those aspects of it are great. I would say if that if you're not um, super into scents, like if you you do smell like it after you shower with it, which like I'm into because I love the smell. But if you're like, oh, I like it in the shower, I like that smell in the shower, but I don't want to like smell myself smelling like that later, then this isn't for you. But I don't think you're that kind of person, you know? Yeah, I believe fragrance stuff is usually really expensive. So if it's lasting and staying on your body, that's like, that's like usually that's more expensive. So it's yeah, expensive. yeah, it's it's really good. And like I can smell like when Jax used it, and I'm like, okay. <laughs> It's nice. It is nice, but I'm also like, that's my body wash. Um, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, but 